You must be one of the twins. How dare you enter my home? Please, Axe, you had no choice. I work for the higher-ups. He's coming with me. What, I don't even get a say in this? I'm not going with you. So you can tell my mother. Forget it. Oh, damn, now your mother didn't tell me how handsome you were. This might be fun after all. You were taking a kiss over my dead body. And I ask that can be arranged. And the name's Roscoe, by the way. You're wasting your time. You can turn right around because London is going nowhere with you. Yeah, we'll see about that. Damn. You're beautiful. Mother didn't tell me that. Listen, we don't have to do this. Can I please talk to my mother? Since you asked me so nicely, I'll do whatever you want. Lena. Like I said, you're not taking London anywhere. I'll kill you first. Nathan, please don't do this. I want to talk to my mother. Well, now it sounds like he's already decided. I'm rolling, by the way. Also, wait a minute, Dad. You're telling me there is a way to get these chips out of our head. And our uncles can do it? Yes, your uncles are brilliant. Just like your mother. They're the ones that put the chips in your heads in the first place. Well, I guess this is really all in the family. I don't trust them either. Look, Dad, maybe if we find our uncles, they could take these chips out. And we don't have to worry about it. We could bury them somewhere. Believe me, I'd like nothing better than to find your uncles. But they're hiding from your mother. They're just as smart as she is. Well, Dad, we have to find them. It's the only way to get out of this. Yes, you're right. Come on, Venzi, are you absolutely sure about this? I mean, we could still make a run for it. Colin, come on, you know, I can't abandon my family. We have to go back. Look, I get it, I understand that she's your mother, but... She's dark and evil. You can't trust her. Look, I know, but she's still my mother. She's not gonna hurt me. I know that. Yes, my love, I know she's not gonna hurt you, but she'd kill all the rest of us. And that's all the more reason why me and my brothers need to talk to her. We can save everybody. Oh, Benzie, I know you'll try. Look, I really do get that she's your mom, but do you really want to do this? Come on, Belle, it doesn't matter if she's running a military. She's still my mom. She's never gonna hurt us. Yeah, well, that's all well and good for you, but she'd quickly destroy the Raider lands. Look, if my brothers and I can get to talk to her, we can make her understand she won't hurt anyone. Well, Kate, and I love that you have that positivity, but I would never trust anybody who's running the military. And don't trust them. Just trust me. Trust that we can fix this. Listen, I don't know if this is a brilliant idea. I mean, do we really want to go and talk to her? She's crazy and dangerous. Believe me, I know that, but she might be the only help of saving these Raider lands. We gotta talk to her. The military's afraid of her for a reason. Yeah, of course they're afraid of her. She's a psychopath. I mean, she doesn't care about anything or anyone. She'd take us out just as quick. Oh, I don't know about that. Sometimes she's got a soft spot. Especially for cute guys. We tell her about the brothers. She might be interested. I don't know, I think we're playing with fire. Look, I know it's not the ideal place, but I think we should go to the new Raider lands. Big Mama can help us. Yeah, I get it. Her place is a fortress, but I don't know if I want to sign up for that. She gives me the creeps. Coward, she gives the military the creeps, and that's the best part of it. They'd never come near the place. Okay, but what's to say when this is all said and done, she helps us with our Raider lands. She might just keep us locked up there. Now, yeah, well, do we really want to trust that the military won't kill us? I mean, this might be our only way out. Right, maybe we'll talk to her, but that's it. Yeah, well, I don't trust any of these ideas. Are you thinking maybe we should go talk to Big Mama? Come on now, love. We really don't want to go to their place. It's a last resort. It's dark and creepy. Ah, that's just rumors. I met Big Mama once. She's not that bad. She just wants the military to think so. Yeah, well, I heard she's got a taste for human flesh sometimes. And she eats people. Yeah, I know. I heard the cannibal thing myself, but I've never actually seen her do it. Yeah, well, how about we keep that on the back burner for now? And let's see how this whole place out. All right, well, I've got our transportation arranged. We're going to get out of here tonight. And I guess there's really no turning back, but I'm afraid of Big Mama and what she might do to us. Yeah, I totally get that. I've heard the stories about Big Mama, but sometimes they're just rumors. And for both of our sakes, we better hope that those rumors are not true so that we can survive. Trust me, I got the feeling Big Mama's all talk and no bite. Yeah, but well, I'm pretty sure the military is all bite and no talk, so we don't have any other choice. Oh yeah, I really don't like this place. I'm feeling claustrophobic already. Come on now, Trina. You know, we don't got any other choice. Military's fixing to come here. Well, I'm about to reconsider going to Big Mama's. I mean, might even be better than this. I'm sorry, babe, but you know we can't trust Big Mama. She's even more dangerous. Yeah, but how do we know those aren't just rumors? I mean, she could be a sweet old lady. I know they're not rumors because I've met a few guys that have been there, and they barely got out with their lives, so we're not going. The 
told you this place was creepy. We need to turn around. I don't like it. I know it's creepy, but look, it's a fortress. I mean, if we go behind there, the military can't touch us. Please, my love, I am not afraid of the military. I'm more afraid of what is behind those doors. Hello, we came this far. Maybe we can just talk to her. I'll admit, if she hasn't shut us down yet, she must be curious. We have to exhaust all of our options before we give up, so let's do this. Well, you know, the military must be coming because this place is almost like a ghost town. Hey, yeah, you don't have to tell me about that. I saw a bunch of cars leaving. Maybe we should go too. Come on, Advance, you know, there's only other one place we can go. We don't want to go to Big Mama's. I don't know, maybe Big Mama's willing to make a deal, I mean. Can't be much worse than what the military's offering, which is basically nothing. Yeah, well, maybe we'll think about it. I think I heard that, uh, Serena's gonna meet with Big Mama herself, so maybe we might want to sit in on the action. Sounds like a plan. Well, I guess we got our answer. Everyone is running out of town, so I don't think the military's going to honor anything. Yeah, well, we all knew that was gonna happen. But our only option is to go see Big Mama. I don't like it. I really don't like it either, but Sonia and Javier went ahead, so let's see what happens. Yeah, well, I also heard Big Mama might be coming here. Serena got a meeting with her. Well, then perhaps we better make sure that we are here for that meeting. Find out what the deal is. Yeah, well, I don't know if I want to get here close to Big Mama. She creeps me out. Yeah, well, everybody's making a run for it, so the military is coming here to probably take this place out. Well, then I guess you're right. We have no other choice. We may have to go and see Big Mama about staying there. Come on, it might not be so bad. I mean, that place is huge, and it's a fortress. Yeah, well, how do I know I shall take kindly to outsiders? Come on, no matter what, we've all got one thing in common. We all hate the city. We're all raiders. We've got to stick together. Oh, we also got to hope that the military doesn't come after her place, too. Might be the last place we can go. Well, I guess you were right. It's official. We need to get back to that mansion. There's a military on the way. Yeah, well, you know I'm always right. You should trust my gut. Besides, we don't want to go to Big Mama's. That's the last resort. Yeah, but I heard Serena might have a deal with her. And Javier and Sonia already went to check it out. Yeah, well, no thanks. I don't want to make any deals with Big Mama. She scares me. Yeah, come on now, Dollar. You know she scares us all, but she also scares the military. Yeah, and that's even more of an incentive to stay away from her. They're afraid of her. She's got to be crazy. Oh my god, Zach, thank goodness I found you. Are you alright? Are you hurt? Yeah, I'm fine. They didn't hurt me. They just wanted to use me to get my brothers here. Where are they? They're on their missions to capture those guys, so I'm here. We're getting out of here. Hey, we need to get out of here because I think we need to talk to the military. I think I know who that guy is, and I think she's looking for him. Wait a minute, are you serious? The guy that captured you. She's looking for him. Who is he? He looked really nervous, like I do, when my brothers show up. I think he's related to her. Yeah, well, I guess it's a good thing that we stayed here because the military's on their way. But damn, I hope Darla and Joey can make it back here before they see him. Yeah, well, we all better lie low in here and not make any noise. Or else we're going to end up there or we're going to have to run to Big Mama's. Well, neither one of those sound like a good option, so let's stay here and be quiet. Yeah, because I really don't want to go to Big Mama's and I don't want to go back to the city. Yeah, you and me both. So, let's not get caught and hope the military just drives on by. Yeah, well, I'm afraid it's as I fared. They backed out of the deal. They're coming here with a full-on military squad. Beats you saying our only options are to die or to go to Big Mama's? Look, I get it. I know it's not the ideal scenario, but Javier and Sonia got back, and they said they didn't shoot him down, and she's willing to talk. She's supposed to be meeting Serena. Jill, of course she's willing to talk. It's more people to come to her lands. She can do whatever she wants to us. Hey, you now you know I won't let that happen. Won't let anybody touch you. Well, you can't guarantee that. No one can. So when's this meeting with Serena supposed to happen anyway? I want to get in on that action. I don't know, but any deals with Big Mama, I don't trust them. I don't know if I want to be here for that. But come on, we already tried the military way and working with Axe. Either one's going to get us a good scenario. Yeah, well, I don't see Big Mama's idea doing any better. I mean, she could kill us all. I don't know about that. I think Big Mama's got some interesting ideas. Besides, she needs more people there. Yeah, well, let's hope not to kill us and eat us. Right, are we absolutely sure we want to do this? I mean, if we go in with Big Mama, it's no going back. Come on, now, Nolan, you know there was never any going back. We're not going to the city, and we're not going to get caught by the military. Yeah, love, I get that. But we can't trust Big Mama. She's got her own plans, and if she doesn't like us, she'll kill us. Look, I get the feeling Big Mama wants more people in her lands, so she's going to be more accommodating. Yeah, really hope you're right, because we're running out of alternatives. Look, she hates the military just as much as we do, so she's on our side. 